Howdy folks, Tex Trebner here with Tex Trebner Outdoors. Who's ready to get wild? I was born under the sign of Karanus, the stag-faced savage god of the wilderness and the hunt to the Paleo-Celtic cultures. I was born to be a hunter, and a hunter I am. Such is the way of our people, since before we struck fire from the living rock, let me tell you a hunting story. Every day of hunting is exactly the same, but every day of hunting is just a little bit different. Different sights, different sounds, different smells, but the same ancient mystery that is the hunt. There will never be a god of golf, but there has always been a god or goddess of the hunt. And I call it an ancient mystery because we have no idea when we go out on the hunt what will come. Today it was a dance of predator and predator. Me, a two-legged predator, and the coyote, the greatest predator in its weight class. I was screaming with a cottontail call and howling out challenges to the local pack set up in a gully on an unseasonably warm April afternoon. I turned my head and a flash of gray within the fence row caught my eye and I came to full draw only to let my bow down when I realized that my excitement had caused my eyes to play tricks upon me and it was nothing more than a broken off fence post within the four wire bar fence and so I continued from my gully ambush to howl out challenges Normally I would be hunting the big woods, but I had decided to set up in this gully so that he couldn't circle around me when Coyote came, if he came at all. Sitting, watching, waiting, listening, the frogs chirping in the pond behind me from the discharge, I was on eye level with whatever would come into the call. Watching the fence row, I had set up in this manner so that I would have plenty of time to see anything that came, and then movement in the grass caught my eye. It wasn't a fence post, it was at 40 yards. I had come to full draw only to let down because my rabbit screamer had brought in somebody's house cat and that was definitely not my quarry. The sun began to sink and I was growing frustrated but still I screamed with my cottontail call and waited in ambush praying to my God that he would bless me with my quarry, that I might consume its heart and wear its skin. And still the dance of predator and predator continued as I screamed out in my distress, pretending to be prey to lure the predator to my ambush. But Coyote, the great trickster, is not so easily fooled by an amateur hunter as me. And so, I packed up my gear, and I will return. As always, God bless all my sports of America. Join the NRA to protect our rights. Please check out my friends over at LegallyConcealed.org. Thank you very much to those of you involved in law enforcement and those of you serving in the military. Thanks for watching Tex Grebner Outdoors. I hope you've enjoyed watching this Tex Grebner Outdoors primitive coyote hunting adventure.